Hey guys, this is Metagross Freak, and something happened I didn't think could. Um, apparently, when the apparently in the Winged Storm, when uh, you go to fight the uh, the Dragons of Destruction, if you stand on the pillar, it, you'll sink through the floor. Um, oh, and apparently the dragons are here. Lovely. Uh. Interestingly enough, all I can do is, uh, oh, I can walk around the edge, apparently. That's interesting. I don't know how I got down here. That's kind of cool. Ah, I'm falling. Oh, there's like a ledge here. That is weird. I'm just gonna have to fall to my death. Yeah, so that that's really weird. Um... So, uh, moral of the story is... I don't know, so, uh, moral of the story is, uh, don't stand on the pillar, or you'll respawn. On the bright side, you get a really cool angle. You get a really cool angle of just all, like, of, of all everything that's underneath the lava. Um, as you can see, all that lava and stuff just changes color, the texture changes. There's nothing going on underneath it. It's basically just hollow. This is all hollow. Um, so, ironically, I just asked uh, King Athalion if he could do a uh, Out of Bounds video. And I unintentionally got myself out of bounds, so that was kind of funny. Well, uh, I'm just gonna, I'm just doing a, uh, I'll, I'll just do this quick run through, that way you can see how quickly Krieg kills the Dragons of Destruction. I realize these guys are, uh, level 38 for some reason, I thought they were 35, but, um, in case you're wondering why I'm fighting the level 35 Dragons, it's, it's, it's because I, uh, I'm just farming for Iridium. Oh, ah, no. Yeah, the fact that I take almost no damage from these guys, and that I can just easily blow them apart. Okay, except for Incinerator. For some reason, he's a little bit tougher to kill. Um, but, you know, I don't really care about that. I, I basically been just doing this to farm for Iridium, that way I can go back into my level. F that way, you know, I can do stuff like other raid bosses or the Tina, t tiny Tina slot machine though I can get you know cool stuff like you know Seraph Crystal since I'm terrible at doing normal level raid bosses yeah I'm not even going back into the uh, not even going back into the uh, the castle to get all the, the different treasure chests Though I did, actually I was been doing this for a little while, I did however pick up a, uh, a, na a slag nasty surprise during the, uh, the loot explosion, which is very exciting because uh, you can normally only get the nasty surprise from uh, Veracidius, the Invincible. It, it's a, uh, one of the more common drops from him. So the fact that I've never even seen that green before was kind of cool. Uh, so is this any good? Uh, I mean, compared to the stuff I have, it's terrible. But I meant like, what's oh, it? Omen's a TD or I thought Omen was a uh, Molly one. Huh. I'll pick it up just just so I can pass it on. I'm I'm also picking up loot for. Uh, my Maya or my Axe, and depending on who I feel like playing next, I, they're both around level 10, level like they're like level 10, level 13 respectively. So if I have some OP loot for them, that might be fun. Cause you know, the best way to do it is by cheating. I'm not cheating, you know that. I'm just uh, 
allocating my resources properly. I don't even know why I'm bothering to try to pick up all this money. It's pales in comparison to what I'm trying to, to what I could get on a, a true vault hunter mode. So yeah, that was a uh, that was a uh, a weird glitch that I fell through the floor. Like literally, the pillar was here. And there, there's the pillar, and I'm seeing it going down, and I just kind of walk right. Th I tried to like walk on it, like I like jumped, and I ended up like falling through the floor. It was really weird. Um, which you know, as you saw, I could like. Ooh, I found a skin I don't have. That's neat. I uh. Didn't really help me. Didn't really hinder me, but at least it uh, at least it's something interesting. So, yeah, King of Thalion, I might have done your job for you, but uh, we still want to see the uh, still want to see the Goliath fight over there up close. I still want to do that. But at least we now know that the the floor is actually, ironically, the floor is not lava. The floor is not lava at all. The floor is apparently just an empty space. So, uh, that's pr that pretty much wraps it up. I'm just going to collect Iridium. So, uh, thank you for watching. And, uh, sorry again that the Discord video isn't up. I, I promise I'm going to do that eventually. I've been, uh, busy trying to sign up for summer classes. I normally don't take us I, I normally wouldn't take a summer class but it was either that or get a summer job at least I'm, I'm assuming with my parents that's going to be an either or option don't really want it to be it and so uh <laughs> that's what i've been up to hey i thought i had stained gloss already that's where sometimes it says i don't ha i have a skin and sometimes it says i don't I'm pretty sure I have stained glass on the bandit technical, though. That's kind of weird. Um, or maybe... I don't know. That's kind of weird. Maybe that was the runner. I don't know. All of the iridium. Oh, am I going to make it to... Uh, am I going to make it to 400? Uh, uh, all out of iridium, it seems. So that, yeah, that was a, that was a pretty decent load for uh, Iridium. Yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, Discord video is on its way. I just have to. I have it basically all set up. In fact, you can see I have a uh, a tab with pictures that I'm going to use in my slides. Um, so yeah, that's coming soon. And there's going to be a couple of the things that I've been wanting to do for like a month or two that I'm finally getting around to doing. So expect to see those in the time. And until next time, I'm Metagross Freak, and thanks for watching.